president chaos erupted during a live television broadcast as a brs mla grabbed a bjp candidate by the throat the incident took place on a regional challenge of telangana during a debate organized among key contestants for the upcoming assembly elections the debate turned violent after the bjp candidate kuna gaud called the brs mla kp vivekananda a land grabber and the war of words soon escalated and brs mla in retaliation grabbed the bjp candidate by the throat and pushed him the fight which was being telecast in live was resolved only after the anchor of the show intervened and separated the political leaders the bjp has now demanded the arrest of the brs mla and has threatened the party of taking legal action my colleague samit joins me live for more information on this samit we do see what really transpired in the visuals that we're seeing on our screens uh, but uh, has the brs mla really come out and apologize for this well you know uh, uh, you know uh, this incident has reported yesterday in the kutbulapur assembly constituency and uh, where a local news channel was conducting a open debate and uh, you know has called the three aspects friends from the three parties that is from the brs are uh, the sitting mla and also uh, bjp aspirant and also congress aspirant has been called to the open debate and later you know their heated argument took place between uh, the bjp uh, candidate as well as the uh, you know the brs uh, you know sitting mla and uh, later they abused themselves and also then later they have attacked uh, you know brs mla tried to attack uh, you know we can clearly see in the visual we are hearing right now uh, i tried to attack the uh, bjp aspirant who is, who is, who is uh, from the uh you know who's from the kutbulla constituency and uh, he's expecting to get from there and uh, later he even, he even uh, can be seen uh, you know uh, you know trying to hold the collar of the uh, bjp leader and uh, today uh, they have lodged a complaint with the local police and uh, they have stated that uh, you know if action has not been taken then they'll be approaching to the election commission of india at the same time mha and they will be lodging a complaint uh, uh, with the eci and mha and also they'll be demanding action